This demo shows four applications we have specifically prepared for an immersive situation. Immersive means that the user feels inside the virtual world and can interact with this 3D virtual world. We have built a beautiful immersive room. Inside, we have five projectors that send images to five mirrors that increase the size of the image and reflect them on the 320 degrees screen. We have also some kinets that allow to have a 3D tracking and also a motion capture device. Here we see pink dolphins. Pink dolphins are used to train autistic children to learn how to communicate. The user commands the dolphins to come out of the water. His gestures are recognized through the kinets and transmitted to the dolphins who react to the recognition of the gestures. We can see here two autistic children from a school in Singapore who are interacting with the dolphins and the teacher at the left side who is quite satisfied of the situation. Here the application is in the medical field. The objective of the immersive application is to train students to do some daily procedures on a virtual patient. The lady is expecting a child and students could touch her belly and take some information about the baby's heartbeat. For doing that, we use 3D glasses to see the immersive situation and a haptic device that gives information on force feedback. In an outgoing study, we are simulating the birth of a baby and students will practice how to grasp the child in the best way. The goal of this third application is to be immersed in a 3D fashion show. We can see the simulation of the clothes while the models walk in the immersive room next to us. We have modeled several garments and virtual mannequins and the user with 3D glasses can enjoy every detail of the fashion show. We have designed and produced real clothes. With the help of an in-house software, we have then created the 2D patterns, assembled them around the virtual body, and simulated the garment using a physics-based simulation software, taking into account the quality of the fabric. This study here is to compare the real cloth to the simulated one and analyze the quality of the simulation. We use here only the screen, which is a glass-free screen, and the user does not need to wear 3D glasses. What is very much interesting is really to compare the real dress on a hanger and the virtual scene. And finally, our fourth application deals with immersive art. Here, we like to study how a user likes to be immersive in some art screen instead of looking at still paintings, sculptures or animated scenes on the 2D screen. Users are fully immersed in the 3D various shapes and has no way to be distracted by anything than the art piece.